hi everybody uh, today i'm gonna show you how you can make light like this if you press a button the light will turn on if you press again the light will turn off you can also change that color so let's start the work uh, please like share and subscribe my channel for more tutorial like this right button create a actor i uh, name it light one you can name whatever you prefer open it now i will add a point light also i will add a box solution and on component begin overlap and on component end overlap from other actor i will cast to my third person character this is the character i'm using you will use your own character so select point light and turn off the visibility get it and set visibility click the visibility on ctrl c ctrl v add with end overlap and turn off the visibility compile and save place the light now you can see that our box collision uh, taken very less space so we need to extend our box collision so box extend i will give 200 200 and 200 compile and save now uh, it's perfect size for my light if we play ultra p and if we go light turn on if we go near the box collision the light turn on and if we go outside the light light turn off so i will change it little, little bit i'll add a key if we go near the box collision and if we press key then light will turn on and if we press key light will turn off so go to project input and i will create a axis mapping light on and i will add the key e now add a, a variable i name it range i just disconnect my visibility and make it move it here i add range here range true and range false on component over level up, over oh, overlap it will be billion overlap it will be uh, turn on and end overlap it will be turn off so get the light on uh, input function and add a flip flop make a space add a branch b mouse left button and add the range here if we are in the range uh, and if we press a press our key then light will turn on and turn off make it like little organized now we need to add one more function uh, their player controller and enable input and it should be on player controller control c and disable input we need to add a disable input and it should be also player controller add it here compile and save now place it here and if we press e it will uh, turn on and turn off if we go inside and press e turn on but if we are outside we cannot turn in turn off we need to go to the box solution inside now we can add a uh, one more function set color set light color and add a random unit vector and it will generate random color whenever we go inside the box collision and turn off the light so we play again and go near the box collision press e the light color is red and every time we turn in and turn off and the color is changing so you can add this function also now i will add uh, another function light to also i will create a material right button and material i name it m um, light I open it I will promote a variable and I'll, I, I will add a parameter in here uh, we can change color like that we can modify color I just give white color but it doesn't matter we can change the color 
and the scale i will add a scale s mouse left button it will create a scale and i will add with multiplier and add with image color compile and save now i will create a material instance and i will open it and there is a base color and there is a scale i will give the scale to 100 and it will look like color like that now go to our light two and delete the point light I will add a spare and I will lower the size this size is perfect I believe you can change the size whatever you prefer but the main point is you can make any mesh as light now delete it because we delete our point light there is a error but it doesn't matter so go here and set material and set material I think control C control V now copy the color our spare color here is our spare basic color and then i will add um, our material instance here is the material instance so it will turn on and turn off the light in now place it here is the light make it little upper here it is perfect so if you play alter p and f11 to full view mode and if you go near press e the light is turned on turn off so this is how you can uh, turn in and turn off your light in that's the function i show you uh, you can add any mesh as your light in so this is for today's tutorial bye bye everybody